Welcome to Film My Run. This is the Liberation Monument in St. Peter's Port. I'm here for the second time to run the Guernsey Ultra, the GU36. And the reason I'm here is it's my wife's very first ultra distance. Well, she's done 27 miles, but that doesn't count, does it? So 36 miles around the coast of Guernsey. Let's see how it goes. Again, absolutely beautiful day today, and we've got far more runners than were here last time I was here. So let's enjoy it. halfway along the cliff section at eight miles. Hello. Hi guys. Hi. Hello. Hello. Uh, yes, please. miles we have a thousand meters of elevation behind us and we've now got 20 miles of relatively flat running to go before that we have coke there. Bay, 23 miles. Are oh, your legs hurting? They're just really tired. Yeah. I'm starting to feel heavy. Are you, have you got any chafing anywhere? But generally okay. Generally. Any stomach problems? Um, I just don't want to eat. Well you've just been eating a nice lolly. Well yeah that's fine but I can't okay. face solid foods anymore. You can't face solid foods? No, I was fine on the first 16 miles eating. Now I just want liquids. Okay. You know what, I genuinely wish it was actually a bit hotter. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> Two years ago I went swimming in that bay there. Tide's a bit far out and uh, I want to help Victoria get to a good time so we're not going to go swimming today. We are rounding the final headland with about nine and a half kilometres to go and we are killing it now. Victoria is tired but still going, still running. So over there are the islands of Herm and Sark and then beyond them is Jersey. Seven hours, 21 minutes. 52 kilometers we have just under 6k to go there's 
the castle over there. The Liberation Monument is somewhere in the middle. And uh, fingers crossed, we might just sneak in under eight hours. Nine and a half minutes to do 1.3 kilometers. Come on, Vic. She's absolutely shattered. She's absolutely dead on her feet, but she's pushing the last little bit now. 500 meters. Come on, Vic. And there we are, another fantastic Guernsey Ultra completed. Victoria finishes in eight hours, seven hours? Victoria finishes in seven hours, 57 minutes. Absolutely amazing, seeing as her goal time was nine hours. That's the Liberation Monument. If you ever want to come to Guernsey and do the Guernsey Ultra, that's what you have to touch at the end of the race. 36 miles all the way around the island. Come and do it next year. You will absolutely love it. Although. It's actually raining. It's raining in Guernsey. Who, who knew? Who knew? So? Yeah, and you can't believe that I dragged you to a sub eight hour finish, can you? Please with yourself? Do you want to show your little back? Victoria got a little badge for it being her first ultra. Like this is a nice surprise. Mm.